I used to have this great grandpa. This motherfucker was racist as shit. He grew up in that generation. You know what I'm talking about. You better watch it, bubs. You're cruising for a bruising. You know what I'm talking about. So one day we out in the field, we doing pig weeds, you know, hoeing them up. And at first the conversation was casual. You know the usual old guy talk. So, you done got your willy wet? Well, let me tell you something. You wouldn't know what to do with a piece of ass if you was a toilet seat. Man, this country's just fucked to damn hell. Then it starts getting racist. I was like, hey man, Antonio's got some of his brothers coming over to the house tonight. They're gonna have a fiesta over there. I know you like Mexican food. If y'all wanna come over, y'all know you guys are invited. I'm missing a beat. This man was like, just some of them or all 48 of them. I was thinking though, I was like, man, white people have big families too. Shit, I see John and K plus eight. But I bit my tongue up until he said some really stupid shit. It's like, you know, black people love chicken. And I was like, who don't? He was all like, oh, we got a smart guy here. Like, shut the fuck up, man, if I come across your head with this goddamn shovel. We've been out here since 6 o'clock this morning. It's 107 degrees out here. I got sweat rolling down the crack of my ass. It's hot as fuck. You out here, 97 years old, you done had seven heat strokes this motherfucking year. And you out here in this heat with your bald ass talking about some, oh, you know, black people love chicken. If you don't take your motherfucking ass, you out here in this fucking field and you got a life alert in your pocket. Are you kidding me?